Oh, woe is me. I do not wish to play Baba is Thee. What cruel fates have ordained this to be? Today will suck. Now that the ritual is out of the way, and we are in the right mindset, we have two new levels to check out. But first, a reminder, which again, those are welcome. Pointing out stuff that I have said or done previously is, is more than welcome, so when I was talking about the whole I, I always get confused by the shut thing, if shut includes stop or doesn't include stop. Someone pointed out this level, in this world, tool shed actually like, kind of let us know how that works, because the whole concept of this level is that door is shut, but the trick is that shut does not equal stop. So there you go. Just, I never remember, but now we know, so like, shut on its own does not convey stop, it has to be stop as well in order for it to be shut properly in that sense. And yeah, this one you just like pushed stuff through the, the door and broke the wall instead by making wall is shut and stuff like that. So yeah, good reminder. Now we can hopefully remember how shut works, maybe. So let's check out Tiny Pasture. Tiny Pasture. It is pretty tiny. Bob is you. Wall is stop and fence is stop. And Kiki is Kiki. So what is what is happening? The flag is Tele. We need to get the win somewhere. Huh. Yeah, what is what is gonna happen here? Hmm. It's not like I can make Kiki sit, like, facing down here, or facing down here. We can make Flag is push, I guess. So, like, if we shift these around, and do Flag is push, and then push Flag in here, This is not gonna work. I think I can get the win out by doing this, but then I, I can't get this flag. Or like, I can't make a rule down here, but... Let's just try it anyway, just to see what happens. So, we do that, and then... I mean, now, now I'm not even making use of Kiki. I was gonna like, have Kiki for some reason sit here and then shift the thing over, but yeah, that, that's pointless. Oh yeah, just doing this and then switching this to Tele again. Will let us get the win down here, but yeah. Problem now is that we can't really do anything with that because I don't have any way to get this up. Unless I could like... Wait, Kiki is shift? That's... no, that's not gonna... This is not gonna work, is it? Like have it shift the flag down or something, if we do it here, like that, and then we remove push, uh, give push to flag, what happens with this? I get shifted down, and the flag gets shifted down. Wait, doesn't this work? And now we just remove push? I was just trying to, like, test some stuff out, but that might have been the, uh, the solution. Now we break that, and then we can just make Kiki's win. We cannot make Kiki's win, because Kiki's shift. We can just make Flag his win. Okay. That was a simple one. But, I mean, again, <laughs> that was, like, I was barely even trying to, to solve it at that point. I was just trying to, like, test around some stuff. Huh. Well, you win some, I guess. And now we have Skull House. Oh boy, sounds scary. Oh, I see. It's another version of this one. Kind of weird that it's like... I mean, I guess it's linked up from Lovely House, but why is it linked up here as well? I guess just because there is no level right here. I don't know, just a bit of a strange layout. So what's happening now? Hold on, we should actually jump out again and just 
Once again, memorized Lovely House. What is happening with Lovely House? Love and doors stop, keys open, doors shut, text is float, water is sink, flag is win. And in this whole thing, the point was we made rock is key and baba to duplicate it. Okay. And meanwhile here, text is float, water is sink, skull and doors stop, keys open, doors shut. Everything outside seems the same. But now the problem is we don't have an and anymore. But shouldn't that be simple then? If it's just the same concept and it's just instead of having an and, we just have to make like rock is Baba and rock is key at the same time. So we have to push in the rock to just make both rules at the same on the same turn. Shouldn't that be very simple? That almost seems like easier than the and level. Uh, so yeah, like don't have this here. Have this here. And then this here. And a key, and we just do that. And now we have two of them. And we do... Wait! Oh god, we don't have open. No, we have open. Yeah, down there. So, key is push. Careful so I don't push Bob as you out of place. Yeah, that was super easy. Like, I would almost argue that one is easier than Lovely House. I feel like understanding that you can do and is almost more confusing than understanding that you can make two is rules at the same on the same turn. But again, I guess that's like because I'm coming back to it and we've seen stuff like that quite a lot in the later levels. And now it just seems simple when if we had just done this right off the bat, it probably wouldn't have seemed simple. I don't know, but OK, that's two down. That's good. Now we have crumbling floor and salvage. Let's try crumbling floor. Wait, what? Haven't I done this one? Moving floor. Oh, okay, yeah, once again, it's... I didn't even check this one, did I? I don't remember even looking at that extra level. So it's uh, another level based on this thing, and once again, what did we do in this one? Belt to shift, Kiki's you, head to stop and bug his defeat. And the whole point was that we had to, like, push stuff into those holes to, like, plug them, plug them up so that I could go down and push the win, and then push the win down and make Baba's win. And there was a trick where, like, we had to make sure to do it in the right order, but I don't remember that order. It was, like, starting with the flags, I guess. Something like that, but not both at the same time, is it? Because, like, we need... Is this fine? Just... Oh, wait. I have to go down as well. Oh, right. So it has to be a word. Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, hold on. Let me just test this. Just because it's been so long, I hardly remember how this level works. So we push down is... We get the win out here. And just one here. Push the flag in there. Oh, no, no, no. Don't do that. Yeah, I guess this is kind of the the tricky part here. We just have to make it vertical instead. But that's fine. Just push that in there. And then this in here. Oh, crap. No, once again. We need words on everything. Right, okay. So we just do it the other way. The flags can only be used to push something in, but they're not push, like, in the end. So we just do this kind of thing? Is that what I did back then? No, I can't do that. Oh god, how did I solve this level again? What do we do here? How did I do this? I don't remember. And I feel like I should solve this one before we go on to the more complicated one. I don't understand. I think I... I legitimately have to go back and check my own video. One sec. Ah. I found it. And, yeah. I don't know, I just got turned around by this one. This one... Could have easily been a pitfall. The problem is just I started by doing two flags. Like that. And then while flag is still push, we can go in and push win. And now I don't have to care about the flag anymore. Because they're already done. And we just like... 
push the words in in place. That's kind of tricky though. I just like accidentally avoided that pitfall when I solved it. Oops. So yeah, that was lucky for me. That's definitely a bit of a a sneaky like what do you call it? I mean sneaky trap. Then crumbling floor. What is happening here? What is the the difference? We don't have that is. Oh god. What? Is that the only difference? We just don't have an is? Everything like outside, belt to shift, kick is you, head to stop, bug is defeat. And we have the win. And the layout, two flags. Two flags, belt to shift, kick is you, head to stop, bug is defeat. We just have to do what we just did with one fewer words? How? How is that going to happen? What in the world? Because, like, I can't get this out of here at this point. We can't somehow get, like, a word, like, in here from this path, bypassing the bugs. Oh, wait, I think I see it. No? Yes? Do I? I think I might see it. Hold on, how does this work? If we just... If we push all of the words into this one. We push both in. Yeah, there we go. There it is. Okay, that's a cool... Cool way to make that one harder. Yeah, it's like you have to realize that you can push in more than one per lane, and then we skip having to leave one on one of the bugs. Nice. Okay, that was good. Once again, I just feel like now I've done good. Now we we can just stop. We can just, you know, leave it at that. It's good. Let's not like mess stuff up while it's going well. But let's try and salvage this. Oh, this one again. Yeah, this one was weird, I remember. Text does not win. Somehow we need to, like, get the flag all the way back, and yeah, this is where I feel like I just tried everything I possibly could. Where we do, like, flag and text as pull. Oh boy. And we can just pull that in, like so, and then break it, I guess, just to think, because like that's, that's obviously a right step, because nothing we've done is irreversible. We just have like the same state, but now we have one more word. But what is, what is happening exactly, like why, why can't I just do this? It's like we don't have, oh. We don't have one more, uh, one more word? Yeah. What? What do you mean? We just don't have enough to pull the flag. So we have to do something with a swap instead. But what? Skull is defeat. And like, I've tried swapping 
the skull. It's probably something weird where you have, like, swap and pull at the same time. Is that it? What happens with that? I, I don't believe that's something we tried. Wait, hold on. What if I just, like... No. I want to, like, move left from here to just swap the swap onto the skull. But hold on. What happens if we do text is swap and pull? Does that have some sort of weird interaction? Text is swap and pull. So I pull it now. And nothing happens. But if I move into it, I swap. So that doesn't really seem like it's going to do anything. And flag is text wouldn't do anything. We don't have a knot. Flag is swap wouldn't matter because I still can't reach it. What the hell? This might be a hint moment, because yeah, I just like... I don't see what else we could do. We can't make use of the mushrooms in any way, like... Yeah, that doesn't even work. Huh. I mean, I guess because mushroom fungus isn't pulled, so yeah, that makes sense. And if we do swap, like... I wouldn't be able to push it out there anyway. Yeah. This one just seems completely hopeless, so... I'll take a hint for this one. Alright, it's four stars. And apparently we're not supposed to move on from levels until you understand swap. So I mean, it is some, like, wonky thing with swap, I guess, but... I still don't understand why that would even help, like, I feel like I understand swap, just not how it could possibly apply to this level. But yeah, I guess that's something, so let's get a gentle nudge. How many pieces of text do you have access to in the pen? How many spaces away are both the swap and win tiles? What? What do you mean win? You mean the flag? I assume you mean the flag. Because, yeah, like, I, I know I don't have enough tiles to reach the flag. With the same pull, we need to do something with swap. I, I, once again, I'm just going to get a bigger nudge, because I just really feel like most of these gentle nudges, they're not even gentle nudges. They're, they just, like, don't mean anything. What exactly triggers a swap event? Does Baba have to be directly involved in the swap? No. We we know that. Like, we can put... Wait. Maybe that is true? Like, if we put something here... Like, text to swap... Then that doesn't do anything with a skull. Oh, this might be it. I might have been on the right track. It is text is swap and pull, but we just need to make sure we already build it on top of a skull. Then maybe something happens. Like we do it here. And then we do text is swap and pull. And then I can... Nope. Never mind. I thought like that would do something where... Maybe, maybe one more? Here? Because now, it's moving onto the skull, and swapping it. There we go, okay, there we go. And then we can pull it out of the way, and then pull this completely out of the way, and make Flaggus win. Alright, that's very tricky. And I mean, I guess that hint worked. I was already thinking about that, but I mean, I guess it just like dialed it in a little more. So sure, thanks hint guide. I'll give you that one.
E. Insulation. Oh, actually, we should leave it off. I'll, uh, I'll wait with this one and do it next time. So, sneak peek. Let's not spoil ourselves. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Minor hint, but at least we made a lot of good progress. Especially up until that point. So, let's hope it keeps going. Actually, I mean, you know, it's gonna suck. It's gonna be terrible. Pessimism, pessimism, pessimism. Get your hopes down for next time.